warfare existential. The rumors of war shall be no more, becoming a very stark reality at the very door. Thus says the Lord God unto mankind and the earth. This was written regarding the days now upon the whole earth. And you will hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that you are not troubled, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. For nation will rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. And there will be famines, pestilences, and earthquakes in various places. All these are the beginning of sorrows. Matthew chapter 24, verses 6 through 8. But now, says the Lord, the rumors of war shall be no more. For the rumors are now about to become skirmish, conflict, battle, and war, which shall then become global warfare encompassing the fullness of the earth. The whole earth shall face a stark and terrifying reality greater than all warfare previously on the face of the earth combined. For now, with mankind's advancements of technology and weaponry, man can now destroy himself with weapons of mass destruction, whether biological, thermonuclear, or both. Such can indeed bring man to extinction quickly. Through Total destruction, decimation, desolation, devastation, annihilation. Shall there be such existential annihilation and extinction upon the earth? Indeed, near annihilation and near extinction shall come by man against man, using his machines, technologies, and weaponries against himself. Why just near annihilation and near extinction? Because I, the Lord, shall stop such from becoming the complete and total annihilation of the earth and the complete and total extinction of mankind. But only at the last second of the last minute of the very last hour of humanity's darkest moment. And then shall mankind take centuries to reclaim, to rebuild, and to repopulate the earth with a very great effort and an even greater struggle to then become only a fraction of what man is today in all facets and aspects. How shall all such begin? In the weeks ahead, when the rumors of war become actual battle and warfare, all leading inevitably to global warfare, of which such shall become existential beyond imagination. End of message. Thusly says the Almighty Lord God, as spoken and written this day, date, and time, of Thursday, the 24th of September, 2015, at 11.01 p.m. American Eastern Daylight Time, Tampa Bay, Florida, the United States of America, the place where my godly name is engraved, published for Sukkot, the Feast of Tabernacles, on the 15th of Tishri in the year 5776, as recorded and posted on Saturday, the 26th of September, 2015.